That was crazy, so what was that the Northmen came and raided his town? And basically blood eagled him? Well, that's what it looked like anyway. I think it was wild. The darkness touched you. Everyone could see it in the hollows of your eyes. A gaze averted from life. You ran from it but brought it nearer. Led it to him. An endless suffering worse than death. And you wanted to surrender. Abandon and divide peace with the gods. No. The darkness won't allow it. So you will walk into the lair of the beast. Look it in the eye. And you will go to war. This is your mission. This is your quest. There is nothing else left. Alright. So, let's let everything load in. Um, we are now on the bridge to hell. Looks pretty dope. I mean, the graphics, you know, are obviously not going to do it justice on YouTube, unfortunately, but the game is gorgeous. I mean, on the, on the Xbox Series X, it looks amazing. Um... Alright, so let's see. There's no going back now. Several enemies will appear on the bridge to stop you, but we know how to deal with them. Alright, as you reach the end of this part of the bridge, open the door only to be ambushed by a deadly two-handed axe wielding nightmare. So right now, we just, all we have to do is just kind of go through, fight enemies, and then that's it. What's up, big boy? Gods made you a warrior for a reason. It's your calling. Sorry. I'm hang of this pair. Oh, I yeah, see. I keep trying to parry with B or dodge with B, and it's not working out. gonna use my focus on that big enemy later on. I forgot, it resets. I don't know, I was, okay. That sucks. Alright, so now we just gotta kinda go forward. And open the door. There's nothing else around here at the moment.
every gate you open into darkness brings another chance. Oh, damn. She not dead. When he closes the door, he's like, nah, this is it, this is it. no going back. Oh god! She's hurt. She's injured. She won't make it. Oh god! Whoa! Oh god. That's not fair, man. Oh god! Yo, this is. This is. Oh my. What? Okay. Oof. What the hell is that? That's interesting. Is that supposed to be there? Alright, that's pretty much it. Just kind of go through this door now. Okay, so here we have a rune door. There should be a lower stone right there. There we go. Alright, now we are so there's two lower stones in this chapter. Um let's just grab this one, just the first However one. you come to the gold covered bridge that leads to hell, you may find it guarded by a giantess. She will ask your name. She will ask your lineage. She will ask your business. 
The Northmen tell of the warrior woman Brynhild, who leapt into fire and rode to hell to join her slain love Sigurd, and is challenged by the giantess. Okay. Alright, so... Alright, wait, hang on. Um... So right now, let's just scan the door. So we need an S, an X, and... The journey to Helheim is never a straight one. Each must find their own path. Align yourself to its secrets, and you will find yours. Alright, this is probably locked. From the outside. So first things first, come over here. And let's see, if we turn around, we can make an X out of this. So that's done. Then... If we go over to the boat... We can actually put these artifacts together and form the bridge back. Which is interesting. So now, we go back over there. Go up the newly formed staircase. And then our next letter will be an S. forward right. as you move onward look for an open window to the left and step out onto the narrow ledge if you carefully move along the ledge you'll come up to a section of rooftop that resembles Senua's mother that you can speak to okay let's go ahead and do that That's cool. Oh, Senua. Your father does not hate me. He just fears the souls in the underworld. He cannot see that they are already afraid. But I am their healer, and I must answer their cries for help, even if it displeases him. All right, we move forward. Go back. And we gotta look for a ladder. It brings us a little bit higher in order to get the symbol that looks kind of like an A. Like a crisscrossed A. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, just a hanging guy. Nope, dead body. Whatever, you know. Alright, so this ladder right here will get us up and we can find the A. Kinda looks like an A, I guess. Alright, we go back down, we can now open that door. There is gonna be another lore stone once we go down this next ladder over here. Which is the final one for this chapter. 
And then also the door that was closed from the outside. We can open it up. Go through the rune door and move on to the last part of this chapter. This was very short, so. Hela possesses large dwelling places in Helheim. Tall are her walls, high are her gits. The name of her dish is hunger. Her knife is famine. On her threshold all will stumble. Her bed is called sick bed, and her bed hangings are called flames of a funeral pyre. They say she is easy to recognize. Half black and half the color of flesh. And her face menacing and grim. Okay. Now we open the rune door and move forward into the next chapter. This far, we just kind of got to move forward. The gate is opening. Oh. Who is it? It's coming. That song again. Source of the darkness. It's coming. This is your moment. I'm sorry. I can't watch this. Oh, that's hello? No. What are you doing? You're showing weakness. You're not a warrior. You're a disgrace. <laughs> The gods will punish you for this. Pick up the sword. Pick it up. Fight the darkness. Fight it. Get up. Get up. Alright. Get up and fight. Oh, oh, her sword's gone. Goodbye. Oh. Stormy seas and lost souls. She's dreamt of this before. They say dreams are visions of our memories, thoughts, and fears, as seen by our inner eye. But what if each one of us is always dreaming, even when awake, and we only see what our inner eye creates for us? Is this what hell is? A world shaped by Senua's nightmares. Maybe that's why people feared seeing the world through her eyes. Because if you believe that Senua's reality is twisted, you must accept that yours might be too. You fail the gods. You're pathetic. Rotten. Curse. What were you thinking? Did you really think you could win? How stupid can you be? Everyone hates her. She's a curse. Look at you. A warrior. Worthless. Weak. Pathetic. Go on. Feel sorry for yourself. Because there's no one left to do that for you. Take it. If you're too much of a coward to fight, then end the suffering. Broken and lost. Just Do like it. your soul. Come on. There. Bruh. I 
guess she's got to cauterize that wound, you know? 